when I tell you guys that I fought for my life to take this video, like I proper had to encourage myself, beg myself, plead with myself to sit down and shoot this video. Not because I don't want to take this particular video, but because I am tired, guys. It's been a week. It's been a crazy week. It's been a demanding week. And I just kept saying, no, I'll shoot the video tomorrow. Then I'm like, no, I'll shoot it tomorrow. I'll shoot it tomorrow. Yesterday, which was Thursday, I thought to myself, no, you know what? I still have Friday to shoot. So I'll wake up early in the morning, shoot, and then um, edit today and post the video. But when I woke up this morning, I had so many work deadlines and stuff to do. Um... Zam is away this weekend, so I was also helping him get ready to leave. One of his friends is going to take out Ilobola, so he's asked a few of the other friends, including Zam, to accompany him to go to the girls' family's home um, for the weekend. And obviously, I think the Lobola thing is happening tomorrow because you know, with men, like you try to ask them, Muti, what's the plan? and they never really know what's going on. He just said to me, I don't know. All I know is that I'm going. I was even thinking to myself, I was laughing. You know how um, people who are not married and they'll be like dating someone and the person will tell them, oh no, I'm going to a wedding this weekend. Or, oh no, my mom is sick. And then they disappear, go to this place only to find out that they were actually getting married. So I was even thinking to myself, if I wasn't married, I'd probably be thinking, hi, hi, Bo, what if Zam is going to get married this weekend and he's busy telling me he's accompanying his friend but he left and my help was off this weekend so she's gone and it's just me and aj so you can imagine how difficult it's been to try like just find time to myself as well to shoot he's currently watching tv and he actually asked me to take him to the park but i was like Unfortunately, mommy needs to work. So, yeah. This is me. We are going to be unboxing. Not an unboxing. Opening up my order from Sheen. Shein. Um, and I'm going to show you guys some stuff that I also bought from Style Alert. I'm just going to quickly go on to Shein. Because as I'm trying on the stuff, I want to tell you guys how much I paid for everything. And there's some, like quite a few people who've sent me DMs asking if Sheen is reliable, what the quality of the clothes um, looks like, and if I'm happy with the quality basically. So guys, my approach to Sheen is that the cheaper the thing is or the item is, the less the quality but when you start buying like usually on Shein, i'll start buying from like if i really like for example you'll see with the codes i knew i needed to pay 400 rand plus if i wanted good quality because if i'm gonna pay 250 for a jacket a coat best believe the quality is not going to be the greatest sometimes you might find that something is cheap and the quality is good but how I usually assess quality on Shein, because I always, like people always ask me, how do I always find such nice things, nice things on Shein? I literally sit, guys, I'll sit on Shein, and if I see an item that I like, I will open it, I will scroll down, I will read the reviews from other people. <clears throat> and then, beyond that, there's some people who, when they do reviews, they will literally, I've been looking there, I need to look here. There's some people when they are doing reviews on Shein, they'll post pictures of the items that they received. So I open those pictures and I zoom into the into the item to try and assess through the phone the quality. Because you can, like you can tell from a picture if something is good, like fabric or good quality or not. Well, at least I can. So I'll look at the picture and based off of that, I'll decide if I'm buying an item or not. So that's my pro tip for when it comes to buying items on Shein. Always read the reviews. Always, um, always 
check the pictures for me when things are less than 300 i always know that when it gets here it's either gonna make me happy or it's gonna disappoint me entirely but at least i know it was cheap and i'm not gonna be disappointed because i know i didn't really pay much for it but as soon as it's like 300 rands plus i know that the chances of it being decent quality or great quality is like higher so yeah let's get into it guys um no yeah, let's get into it so guys the first thing that we are going to try on is the striped jersey so this is the first thing i am trying on it's the striped jersey um and it's currently a must-have item i think in any girl's wardrobe a lot of ladies especially on my instagram are buying um a striped jersey so it's the first thing i'm trying on and yes aj what's up what's up yes leave leave the painting please 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 what are you watching okay great stuff go watch it please wanna break your teeth my god guys i love this top slash jersey absolutely love it the quality is like perfect um in terms of weight it's not thick it's not heavy but it's also not light like it's perfect really 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 like this top and i'm glad i decided to order it on sheen because that's quite a bargain um at poetry it's like 900 rands and there's like other places that sell it for like really really expensive and on sheen it is actually 286 rand it's called the sheen frenchy striped pattern drop shoulder sweater i love it okay i'm gonna put it on now i just don't want to mess i don't want to get it dirty with my makeup so I need to be very careful but I am I'm obsessed man I love love this top I think I'm gonna style it so nicely and it's gonna look so cute let me just tilt this but this is this is what this top looks like obviously guys I'm wearing clothes underneath because it's gonna take me forever if I have to take everything off and on and put on off. Yeah. So this is what it looks like. This is what this top looks like. This is what my top looks like. And I am so in love with it. Ah ah ah. I'm gonna look so cute when I finally style it. It's so cute, guys. What do you think? love 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 it great purchase i'm happy so yeah let's try on the next thing so the next thing i am going to be trying on is this it's called the daisy drop shoulder slant pocket single breasted split hem trench coat that's a long name but yeah this is the next thing that I am going to be trying on and the price is 365 so this is 365 I'm keen I think I'm gonna like it I think I'm gonna like it this is what it looks like this is what it looks like this is what it looks like okay so my first impression of this jacket is that it is very very light for a trench coat it is quite light but the material does not feel cheap the material is actually very decent although the jacket itself itself is quite light the fabric um still feels 
like good fabric like good fabric was used for this um, I'm now gonna try it on to see how it looks on me I'm not mad at it I think it's I think when I style this it's gonna look cute like as an outfit it's gonna look cute and also guys this is obviously not how I would dress up um, or style these all these items it's just like I said I'm not gonna be taking or changing into different outfits for this because firstly it's gonna take time and secondly I still want to be doing reels on my Instagram styling the different items so I think I will save that for Instagram um, so that's even more reason for you to follow me on Instagram if you do not follow me already I really like this um, it is so stylish it is so cute i wish i wish it was longer or maybe i got a big i don't know i wish it was a bit longer um or is it fine i'm not sure i'm not sure how i feel about it i don't think it's bad i really don't think it's terrible um i just wish like with trench coats i usually like something that's like a bit i don't know how to explain it. it's like a bit bulk not bulky but yeah it must look trenchy man this looks more like a it's got the fit of a cardigan it almost feels more like a cardigan as opposed to a trench coat but i think that it will still look cute when i style it with the appropriate outfit so yar yar i'm trying to move back let me try show you i'm gonna try show you the length the length this is the length of the trench the lighting gets so bad when it's not focused but this is the length of this coat what do you think up next is another coat it's called the sheen double breasted trench coat um I think this might or will end up being my favorite thing, but I don't want to speak too soon. So the price for this coat is five hundred and ninety-four, so five nine four. And yeah, let's try it on. Dim, 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 dim. It's got a belt. Unlike the previous one that I tried on, this. I'm lying guys I actually told you guys the wrong thing this is not no this is not what I thought it was this is I think this is the sheen is where lapel collar drop shoulder double breasted belted trench coat in military green and the price for that is 280 no 322 so this is 322 so yeah, I thought it's the other jacket, the longer one, but this is not, this is not long. It's literally like just a short half trench coat. And this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Fabric feels, it's ideal. I like it. Like it's, 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 I can work with this fabric. I am happy. I am happy for the price. For the price, I can work with it. And this is, let me just fix it in the mirror. But this is what it looks like. Let's take the camera down. This is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. And this is the back. You can wear it open or you can even like close it. It's double breast so yeah this is what this looks like this is what this looks like here's an up close it's quite light yeah guys so this this coat is not like the best fabric it's not like amazing it's not something to like rave about it's quite light and it feels not cheap but it doesn't feel like the best quality 
but I, I still think this is cute like you guys are gonna see how I'm gonna style it like when I finally do wear it properly and I think you can work with it if you want something to work with this has amazing potential so yeah I am happy I don't regret I don't regret getting this for the price I'm happy let's try the next thing so now we're gonna try the other trench coat that I thought was this one or that I thought this one was um, oh by the way this has a belt let's actually let's actually see how it looks with the belt let us actually see how it looks with the belt I think that some of you might actually be interested to know or see what it looks like with a belt let me not do this coat at this service or injustice there we go um, if I was to tie it so if you were to tie it do you guys prefer it like tied or do you prefer it open so this is what it looks like when you tie it I think I think it looks cute I think this looks cute like you guys are not ready for me to style these stuff or these clothes but let's try on the next one the next one it's I can really feel it's heavy it is heavy it's heavy and that's the one I said is called the double breasted trench coat it is 594 and it looks stunning on the picture that I saw on Sheen so I definitely knew I had to buy this one when I saw it and let's try it on Ooh, child I love it already I have not tried it on and I am already obsessed with it it's stunning this is a stunning coat and guys you would literally pay 2,000 rands for something like this at Zara or 2.5 so for Sheen for the quality for the look this is a bargain and I would highly highly recommend that you get this jacket the arms the arms are a bit big guys the arms are quite or slightly big but I can work with this let me fortunately this so this is what the arm looks like and fortunately you can like make it tighter so I think because of how big it is I'm gonna need to basically tighten it so I'm gonna try and do that now on the one arm just to see if it makes a difference um, but the quality of this is very good the quality is very yeah much better so this is the side that I've adjusted and this is like the normal side um, I think I'm gonna remove the camera and show you what it looks like like full length because it deserves it deserves full length this jacket deserves full length in the mirror so let's do that the sun is starting to set guys so it's getting like really dark in here i think i might switch on the light even though it might cause a flicker but yeah it's getting quite dark very quickly like the sun is setting very very quickly actually you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna grab my phone and use my phone instead for the full body image or full body video instead of having to like take out the camera from the tripod my camera is dirty but yeah let me show you what it looks like um Uh, last item from Sheen is a leather dress 
um i've wanted to get a leather dress for quite some time um but i wasn't clearing my card and now that i finally decided to clear the card i was like this i need to get i'm not sure about the quality but i've gotten leather pants from sheen before so i decided and i and they were really good quality and they're still in perfect condition i was like let me try out the leather dress from sheen and so i went through a couple of them and this was i think the best one in terms of like look fit and style this was the one that i liked i hope it's not too long and not too short but i will most likely wear this with i'm gonna most likely wear this with like a, a puffy sleeve white formal shirt and this is what it looks like so the price for the dress is i'm gonna quickly check uh, what is going on what is going on sorry guys okay here yeah, shipped so the price for this dress is 337 337 it's obviously faux leather i think it's cute and i think it's gonna look cute on me so let us try it on i wish i was wearing a white i wish i was wearing a white top because then it would contrast nicely with the black and you'd be able to see it properly but i'm just gonna try it on with this top i think you guys will get an idea of what what it really looks like so let me put it on and show you guys <laughs> guys this is what i'm trying to move back but this is basically what it looks i'm trying to I'm sorry i'm trying to move my shoes this is basically what it looks like um i'm not sure if it's too long is it me or it is a bit long is it just me or do you guys think this is perfect in terms of length and then just imagine me wearing a white formal top that's like poofy on the sleeves and you've got a very cute outfit with like boots plus by the way i've got white boots i've got white boots i've got white boots that are also from sheen so this is this is the last thing that i ordered from sheen i just quickly want to double check how much i paid for these they are 421 and i like these i like these boots i've never owned white boots like ever so i really really like this the quality is very decent they're not uncomfortable they're very comfortable actually i wore them for a shoot last week and the outfit was absolutely cute i'm lying this is not the last thing i bought from sheen the other thing i got from sheen was the half trench um a half trench coat that is in the image that is about to pop up so the image that just popped up now that is the other trench that i got and i'm going to give you guys the price for that as well it's actually over here this one this one this one it is called the daisy buckle raglan sleeve design crop trench coat and i'm obsessed love it love it love it love it love it i actually saw it for the first time from my sister-in-law they sell this exact jacket at zara and for way more but it was sold out at zara so my sister-in-law told me that they've got it on sheen and that she got hers from sheen as well and sheen she in she in she in so yeah got it for myself and i am happy with it i would like i would buy this like if i was watching my youtube channel and i saw this this i would buy it um as i said I've, i wore it for a shoot and my outfit was cute paired it with these shoes as well i'm gonna put on these boots for the dress that i'm wearing now just to see how it's gonna look i'm not saying this is how i would style it but i just want to see oh actually it looks hot it looks cute this outfit actually looks cute 
this outfit looks cute i wish this i actually wish this dress was shorter like i wish it was shorter like this this kind of short what size did i get what size did i get i'm trying to see what size i bought but i wish i got it in a smaller size i got size small i don't even think they've got extra small oh they do have extra small i really think I should have bought this in an extra small. Guys, I'm all alone with AJ, so I can't even zip up the dress. But I want to show you the full length of this outfit that I'm currently wearing. Um, so, yeah, this is the full length. And it's not even buttoned up at the back. But this is the full length with these boots. I wish this was shorter, like, if it was, like, this short, I think I would vibe with it a lot more. But I'm not mad at this length. I'm not mad at this length. I think it's actually decent. What do you guys think? Would you buy this dress? Would you buy these boots? What do you think? Those are all the things that I got from Sheen. Now I quickly want to show you the two, the three items that I got from Style Alerts um, leather pop-up store. So she was selling everything, anything made of leather. She had, she had pants, she had jackets, she had skirts, like you name it, hats. And so I bought two jackets and some other, some other things skirt looking like thing it's not really a skirt but it's a thing i don't know what it's called but i have been on pinterest to try get like outfit inspo so i'll try show you i'll try put up a picture of what ideally it's meant to look like but let's get into the jackets first first up is my absolute favorite one it is so hot it is so sexy guys this could actually this that i'm wearing now could actually be an outfit could actually be an outfit i think of this yeah it's it's actually not bad but this is the jacket that i got from style alert how cute how cute how cute i love it i love it so much i love it so much i think this outfit that i'm wearing now is actually it's a vibe it's a vibe what do you guys think so the jacket was i think 950 or 940 that's quite expensive i won't lie but it's real leather it's real leather it's gonna last for years um i'm obsessed it's cropped I think there's many, many, many ways to style this jacket and I really like it. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of this? Let me step closer into frame so you can see the detail, the detail. I'm, I'm in love, guys. I am in love. I am in love. It was at this point when I found this jacket, I'm like, I'm glad I woke up to go to this thing. And I'm glad I listened to my sister-in-law and just went. Because I think even like when I told her I don't want to really go anymore to the pop-up store. It was just me being lazy. You know sometimes guys you make plans or you say you're going to do something. And then come Saturday morning you wake up and you realize actually maybe I just want to sleep. But she was like vuga vuga sister go hamba hamba. And it was worth it. It was worth it. Let's do the second, let's wear the second one so you guys can see. The second um, leather jacket doesn't really go with the outfit that I'm wearing. But guys, I'm not going to change. I'm just going to show you what it looks like. And then you guys can tell me what you think. Guys, it is so dark. Like, it's dark now. So I apologize if the quality is, is not decent. This is the other jacket. Guys, remember... I'm not going to be styling this jacket with this outfit. I am merely just showing you what I bought. So let's go and judge Please. This is the other jacket that I got. So hot. So unique. How nice is this? How nice is... 
how nice is this jacket it's so unique it's so different like i love it the cherry on top is that it's real genuine leather and it is it is stunning it is stunning so this is the jacket what do you guys think what do you think let me know in the comments section actually it doesn't look too bad with this look but it does not work um yeah i would style it completely different i think this with something white like a white a cute white dress or um i don't know i'll have to think about it a bit more but i like this jacket love it love it love it um the last thing that i got i don't even know i'll probably won't be able to wear it on top because it's black i don't think you'll see it properly but it's this thing guys i don't know what this thing is called i really don't know what it's called but you wear it like like imagine a white formal shirt um a baggy one like a big baggy white formal shirt with this thing on top then you will know how to style this thing let me just try pull it up let me try to pull it up you literally put it like on top you would put it on top of your white shirt maybe i must quickly run and go get a white shirt guys i am tempted to show you properly what this is meant to look like my stuff still has tags this is basically supposed to look like this is basically i could actually no i don't think these these don't go really well together so i think i'm gonna quickly go grab a shirt to try this with so let's hold it right there i know it's like super dark right now but hear me out so this is how this is how you basically rock this thing you pop it over a dress or like a shirt like this and you're good to go i'm gonna take a full body so you guys can see where's my phone where is my phone there there there, there. so cute so cute i don't even think i need to do a lot of talking um i think it's giving sexy it's giving cute it's giving stylish i like it so much quickly want to show you what the full body looks like is the full body guys this is a look this is a look this is a look you will definitely see me rocking this look very soon i'm obsessed i am obsessed i am obsessed but i'm so cute guys i feel so cute i like this thing i love this thing what do you think and yeah guys that is it from me and my haul i hope you guys enjoyed it i'm not sure if it's going to be a long or short video but i don't think it's going to be too long but i hope you guys are not mad and that it was worth it and that you enjoyed the video let me know in the comment section what your favorite item was that you saw in this video and yeah i am i'm so happy i shot this video i am so relieved um so by the time you guys see this i would have edited and obviously posted it i really hope you enjoyed it show me some love in the comment section let me know what your favorite item was let me know if you'll be buying anything and i will link all the products in my description box so yeah give me a thumbs up comment like subscribe share this on your instagram and tag me love you guys and have a lovely weekend